What's up? In this video, I'm gonna show you how to install WordPress so that you can start building your own website. Now, there's two ways to install WordPress. The first way, which is the most common way, is through a web hosting provider. And a web hosting provider is where you get your domain name and your hosting plan for your website. And my personal provider is HostGator because they're affordable, fast, and reliable. So if you don't already have a domain name and a web hosting plan, then just click on the first link in the description in order to get it. That will take you to HostGator where you can get them for a massive discount. Now, the second way to install WordPress is locally on your computer. But in order for your website to actually go live on the internet, you're still gonna need a domain name and a hosting plan. So I'll be covering how to install WordPress locally in a separate video. So keep an eye on the description for that as well. In this video, we're gonna be covering option number one, which is through a web hosting provider. So let's get this started. So first things first, we just need to log into our web hosting provider. So I'm on hostgator.com and I'm just gonna do customer login and then portal login. Okay, so now I'm logged into the dashboard of my hosting account and this is also called my cPanel. Now to get to WordPress, I'm just gonna go over to the marketplace. But a quick tip if you don't have HostGator is that it's probably gonna be called something like CMS installs or one click installs. That's what you're looking for. Okay, so inside the marketplace, I'm just gonna scroll down and then you'll see one click installs right here. So I'm just gonna click on that. And then you'll see WordPress right over here. And WordPress is free. And there's a lot of other website builders in here, but to be honest, WordPress is the best. So we're just gonna click on WordPress. And then from here, all you have to do is just select your domain. And I've got a lot. So you should just see your domain names in this list. So then once you've selected the domain that you want to install WordPress to, you can just leave this as directory and then click on next. Now, just give your new website a name. So I'm just gonna call mine, create a cool website. And then admin user, I just do my first name. And then I'll just put my first name again, my last name, and then just an admin email. And then all you have to do is just agree to the terms of service and then just click on install. Cool, and once it's installed, you'll be taken to a page that looks like this. And what you're gonna wanna do is just save this information right here because especially this password, you're gonna need that in order to log in to WordPress. Okay, so instead of clicking on that little yellow login button, the way that you should always get used to signing into your WordPress is by typing in your domain name and then putting forward slash WP dash admin. That is the way that you should always get used to signing into WordPress because that little login button is gonna be gone once you publish your website for the first time. Okay, so let's go ahead and log in. Okay, so we'll just open up a new tab and then we'll just type in our domain name and then we'll just do forward slash WP dash admin and then just hit enter. And now we can just log into WordPress. So it's just my name was my username and then I'm just gonna paste that ridiculous password from earlier and then just click on login. Cool, and now you're inside your new WordPress dashboard. All right guys, so that was how to install WordPress. Now, if you wanna learn how to use WordPress so you can start building your website, then I will put a link in the description to my video called WordPress Tutorial for Beginners. So feel free to check that one out. And rumor has it for every new subscriber I get, a baby elephant learns how to swim. So do it for the elephants or do it because you want website tips, tricks, tutorials, and so on. All right guys, thank you for watching. I will see you on the next video.